Just go back to the show. No, we're not going back to the show, folks. This is a dangerous situation, okay? I'm sick and tired of people complaining about this. Our job here is to keep people safe, and that is what we're going to do. Some of you complain that this is all about my ego. Stop. Okay, just stop right now. It's not. I'm done with you people. I really am. This is pathetic. <laughs> So we are going to do a mukbang, a mukbang, whatever, whatever you call it. It doesn't really matter as long as you, you get the concept. We're going to do a hothead mukbang, 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 and story time. <laughs> a lot has happened in the last 24 hours. Not even. A lot has happened in the last 12 hours. And if I look sweaty, I probably am because I don't have my car on, right, car on right now. It's 90 degrees outside. Right. So let's hurry. I can't get this shit open. How am I gonna hurry this up? Before I start, I didn't know you're supposed to tip a high head. Or it's full She didn't give my fucking rings, did she? Oh, she didn't. I don't I didn't know you're supposed to tip. Well, in my my theory is you shouldn't. In my theory, which is gonna piss a lot of waiters and waitress off, but the truth hurts. In my theory is you don't need I'm tip my theory is I'm tipping you on your service that's what it tips for see I'm just gonna tip you for what tip you for being okay first of all look she didn't even make my meal then she got she got an attitude when I hit no tip <laughs> the last 12 hours has been a a roller coaster a roll you guys can't even see the food up huh? last 24 hours has been a roller coaster ride my city, Dayton, Ohio, and many cities around got hit with three tornadoes last night. Unexpected ass tornadoes. And when I say unexpected, watching Bachelor and Jamie Simpson comes on. Jamie, get the fuck off. We're watching Bachelor. Do I not have a oh, I'm looking for the fucking I'm looking for the fork and it's in there. Jamie Simpson, get off. We're watching Bachelor. <laughs> Ohio, we get tornado warnings all the time. Nothing ever happens. When I tell you, I was literally just watching Bachelor, and I wasn't watching Bachelor. <laughs> I'm just making it dramatic. This motherfucker is hot. God. <coughs> I get the warning. First of all, I never see a warning that says, Riverside, Ohio. That's where I'm from. I'm from Riverside, Ohio. There's always like Dayton area, Montgomery County area. It's never like put like a precise location on it. So I get that. I get that notification. Sorry, home. Um. It said Riverside, Ohio, because you get that annoying ass Amber alerts. I'm sitting there like, oh shit. Like I go wake up my mom, and we're both talking about. It. We turn on the news. And this shit says it's in Huber Heights. Huber Heights is like 10 minutes away. It says it's in Huber Heights heading southeast. And I'll put up it right here. I'll put this up. I'll put this map up. If it says southeast, it's literally coming this way. Yep, walk it downtown. Mm -hmm. Head into possibly Huber Heights right past Riverside area. Correct. <laughs> I'm laughing because, I mean, it's, it's a serious issue. If I go wake my dad up and like, this, it gets serious. Like, this is where the park gets serious. Like, I wasn't taking it serious at first. In a serious moment, I'm gonna laugh. Or, like, just like. Cause, like, I just. I, I'm, I'm a life lover. I love life. Get on, like, a live broadcast of, like, the area. Sorry, I'm not eating when I'm doing this. I hate talking and eating at the same time. Get on a live broadcast of the area. And then my dad tells me. It. My dad tells us once, if that power goes out, get the fuck in the closet. And oh my god. They cleared out this closet, they grabbed the dog. I sat in my own closet by myself with my cat. <laughs> when that power went out, were you oh my god, my heart dropped. I was running. Cause this this is some shit you see in the movies. You don't ex ever expect a natural disaster to happen to you. But you can't you don't understand it until it happens. If you guys can relate to this at all, I hope you can relate to this. If you can't, you honestly just have to go through it to really like understand.
I'm sitting there curled up in a ball in my closet with my cat in my arms. He's trying to run away. As soon as them lights went black, oh, I grabbed my book bag that I have right here. I have my book right here. I grabbed my computer, stuffed my computer, my beats, my camera, every, no, I forgot my camera at first. I stuffed everything in the closet with me, like wrapped around me so I wasn't gonna lose it. And then my cat's like freaking out. And I, I'm like, oh fuck, it's real quiet. I should go get my camera real quick. So I go run and get my camera, I get back in the closet. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta like, prioritize. Our house didn't get messed up. A lot happened around it. When I tell you this hurricane, okay, say so this is this is my house right here. My head's my house. <laughs> I don't know, this is a good example. My head's my house. This hurricane went like this. All my roads on this side are fucked up. All my roads on this side are messed up. Like, I think it was I was praying my ass off and I was praying in that closet that it didn't hit us. And it literally moved right there. We're kind of in like a valley. So a lot of valleys didn't get hit. This, dude, these, there was three tornadoes back to back. But yeah, I'll be showing aftermath throughout this whole video. So if, it's just it's just an insane experience. You don't really know. It's so shitty, because no one deserves to go through that. No one deserves to lose their safe place. Imagine just losing a house. Like, that's one thing. I would never wish losing a house or losing a car on somebody ever. the experience I I'm praying for everybody who's going through it because dude this is bad it was an EF3 if you know what that means it's like it was like a super disaster like it wasn't no fucking it was <laughs> it just missed us I don't I don't know guys like I don't know if it was the prayer I don't know what I did what if, what did I, what the fuck did I do what am I doing right I don't get it yo hey how does it go to such a shitty day to 91 degrees outside and sunny? It don't make it any better. KKK rally or whatever. And let me clear something up. Dayton, Ohio declined the KKK rally in the first place. And then the Ku Klux Klan sued the city of Dayton. And it was either pay that much or let them have a rally. Which you should have just paid that much. But... People think that Dayton, Ohio, like, wanted the rally. That's crazy. And they're, like, they're, they're saying, like, oh, that, this is, isn't that a coincidence? They're saying, like, isn't that a coincidence? You guys have that KKK rally, and then you get hit by three tornadoes. Huh. You deserved it. Come on. I told my fellow Ohioans, if you went through something like that, there's light around, there's light just around the corner. It's not always gonna be like this. It could be the worst situation. It just look, pick out all the positives in it. I mean, there's no, there's no positives of like a natural disaster, but it's just one of them things you can't control what's happening. So control the way you respond to it. Story time. If you guys, if you guys like story times, I have a lot more stories to tell. <laughs> I, I, I live a weird life. I wanna know more like story times and mukbangs where I get like other people in and we can have like deeper conversations or more interesting. Cause this is kind of rushed. I'm fucking, I'm burning up, dude. You can see the sweat drenched. I'm drenched. If you guys, if you guys like this video, give it a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. I'm sorry if my posting is weird this week or like couple weeks, cause my power's still out. So I, I mean like, I don't even like being home. I don't have air conditioning. It's just like, it sucks. But I have a house. I'm alive, and that's all that matters. It's just like, I don't even want to go home. 